but uh, you, uh, you know, run for the next few years uh, to, to worry. To say something, of course, I think uh, to Formula One is tennis group, and uh, my sense to be a bit correct, so you know, I'm trying to focus my job and uh, think that if uh, the driver is not to decide something, I'm driver to just show the performance and uh, someone pick me up. So I think uh, the point is just try to work hard for myself, and of course, I think for the next year, I have an opportunity, I will work to the Formula One. Uh, Why should I take the hit for all of them? The reality is that it's an impossible question to answer because each circuit and each set of circumstances, you also don't know how good that particular car is against anyone. And I'm not going to get dragged into a confrontation where I'm going to say somebody and then get it wrong. So I'll do a dead cool card on this and just pass. I think the people, what you have to understand about Formula One is that there are 22 cars, 22 drivers, and at the moment they are currently the best drivers in the world. So don't get too carried away. They are all outstanding in their own capacity. And each of them in a given car could do an outstanding job and could go on to be wrong. The car has such an important factor in this, you only need to speak to Jensen about that, that the combination, the link between everybody, and one driver, you know, somebody's going to say Jensen, somebody's going to say uh, Alonso, somebody say Hamilton, what's the point in, in deciding and making one person uh, outside the net workers? They are all absolutely outstanding. And the important thing about Moscow, which is what I want to bring it back to today, is that you are being served up with a current world champion and lots of drivers who are outstanding, who would be brilliant and could be world champion in the right car, given the right circumstances. This um, circuit is, uh, is more about the right lines because it's, um, it's very bumpy compared to a normal circuit, which is understandable because it's a road um, and it's built for road cars, not Formula One cars. Uh, so the cars are a lot higher than when in race situations, which is a good thing also for the wet because it means you don't have uh, aquaplaning through the floor being on the ground. Um, we have wet tires here as well, so uh, it's, uh, it's not an issue. Um, for us at all. Plus, I think it's more about the show here. It's not about us driving as quick as we can around the circuit, because if we do that, you're going to see us for one second as we pass you. It's more about what we can do with the Formula One car and, uh, and, and the show that we can put on it for, for, for the fans out there. at the end of the future also of the developments in, uh, in Russia. So in cooperation with uh, G-Drive, which is also uh, our partner for GT Academy, we are going to be in four different towns in uh, August, uh, mainly in Siberia and Boras. Uh, the last one will be Ekaterinburg, where we will be, we will be something like the 25th of August, if I remember correctly, and we will read the cars so that people can see them, can test them, and all the digital activities that you can discover today. And I invite you to go there and to see all the things we are proposing, uh, so that at the end, as with GT Academy, the, the motorsports activities can be affordable to everyone. And that's uh, something we start to develop beginning of August. The program is available on our website, and I invite you to, to look for it. Спасибо, Дерк, спасибо, Филипп, ваши аплодисменты, пожалуйста. Другие еще вопросы? Thank you, mate. I don't know, to be honest, uh, to be honest, you know, uh, we are here for this, and so I have to be, to be, to be funny with everyone, because uh, the team requested this to me, so I try to, to do my best. And, uh, I know, I don't know, the track will be safe today at 1 o'clock we have the show, so I try to, to do my best to make, uh, to make the public happy. I know I've never been here and uh, I just
just from the track looks it looks interesting to me. Uh, some fast corner, long straight, so we try to bring some speed in it and some try to do some uh, some stupid tricks and uh, makes it makes the people happy. And to be honest, you know, we hope for uh, for the good weather because. Uh, I mean, it's uh, still okay if the track is wet, but uh, I think they can uh, they can enjoy more if, uh, if the track will be dry because uh, we can do we can do a better job like drivers and uh, we can uh, we can have some more fun, no? And then, uh, apart of my apart of that, uh, personally, like a driver, usually I'm really a big hard driver to be honest and. Uh, Maybe I'm not the best one in qualifying, but in the race I'm, I'm stronger and harder at the end, so I will try to do my best and I hope to have a, a good chance in Formula 1 to become a racing driver. And to be honest, here we have some great drivers, uh, Kovalainen, and won races in the past, the Jason Patton uh, was an expo champion, uh, is an expo champion, so I think uh, it's a pleasure for me to be here with them and uh, I will try to do uh, a good job uh, like that today. Thank you.